Welcome back. In this video, we'll be talking about medium vessel vascularis, and we'll talk in details about Kawasaki disease, polyarthritis nodosa, and thrombongyris disease. To remember the symptoms of Kawasaki disease, remember crash. So conjunctivitis, rash, adenopathy, usual in the cervical area, strawberry tongue rash, and hand and foot edema. Commonly, a patient with Kawasaki would die because of coronary artery aneurysm. The treatment is different from other medium vessel vasculitis. We give Kawasaki disease patients immunoglobulins and aspirin. The hallmark of polar arthritis nodosa is renal artery microaneurysms. The presentation is very important. The patient will usually have viral hepatitis, followed by rash. The pathophysiology is autoimmune in nature, and we treat it by immunosuppression. The patient might have other unspecific symptoms such as fever, hypertension, melina, etc. Just keep in mind that polar arthritis nodosa is rash preceded by viral hepatitis. Thromboangitis, which is also known as Brueger disease, which is simply atherosclerosis caused by smoking, resulting in gangrenes, claudications, and renal phenomena. So the treatment is obviously smoking cessation. Alright guys, that's everything I've got. Hopefully I made this easier for you. Um, thanks a ton for watching and I'll see you guys later.